Charlie Kirk and Candy Owens were sitting in a hall having their discussion when during the discussion an Iranian boy stood up from his seat and said some things that might make you feel for once that those born in the USA perhaps don't value the USA as much as those who come from outside and settle in the USA what this Iranian boy said let's see straight on the video those who are new on the channel don't forget to subscribe to the channel let's start my name is Mohammed. I'm a legal immigrant from a whole Islamic tyranny called Iran. And uh, <laughs> nobody appreciates the Western world more than the people who suffered through dictatorial, top down authoritarian regimes. And my family. Amen. That's point number one. Point number two is that uh, the gentleman in the back doesn't know how spoiled he sounds when he talks about racism in America. Check your American privilege, my brother. You said American privilege. That's how it feels when people stand up and I say it's not realistic anymore. When you start to say that blacks are suffering just as much today as they were when my grandfather was coming up, it's like how privileged. It really is crazy. And I don't mean to be, you know, use an ad hominem attack, but it quite literally is, is within the realm of lunacy when you start saying that. And it shows you what the problem is, is that people our age, people your age, which are younger, we haven't lived through anything. And when people make comments like that, it's an insult to what people that actually lived through something did. It seems to me that people have become very delicate or perhaps they don't realize the sacrifices their grandparents made to make this country prosperous. The path their grandparents took to come to this country, how difficult and challenging it is and because of them we are living in a country where most people in the world want to come. I think we should enhance our thinking positively and move forward. If we keep winning with victim mentality, we might slow down the pace of our country's progress. Appreciate your country, appreciate your grandparents who made this country prosperous. And now if there is any country in the world that is called the most powerful country in the world, then America's name will be at the top. Let me know in the comments what you think about this video. If you liked the video, don't forget to subscribe the channel. Thank you very much for listening and supporting me. Take care.